what is your best? And when I say the best, it is the best, best, best memory you have of all the filming of the movies. Very difficult thing. <laughs> Should we also include what they filmed recently, I think, with the reunion? Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. They include also that. Can we go first? Yeah, do you wanna... No, you go first. Okay. Can we go first? No, uh, go I'll take it. I'll take it. Oh, that gives me a minute to think. Um, when we were filming, we're, uh, we're all in this together. You know, that little moment. Um, when we were filming that, I remember Kenny Ortega, he stopped the music. And he paused and he said, did you guys just feel that? I feel like something special is happening. And we all were just covered in chills. And we knew in that moment that we, we were doing something really special and really magical. And I feel like it set the tone for all of the high school musical movies that we knew we were going to change the world. We were going to do something big. And I, I will never forget that moment. It was a truly magical moment. Well, what's, when was that? What song was that? That's where we're all in this together at the fir at oh. the end of the first film. It, uh, in the in the, the basketball yes. uh, at the end. Oh, it was big. That was really big. It was really big, and you could feel that something special was happening. Yeah, yeah. You know when? Do you want? Do you want to translate or do I go? Okay. So um, for me, it's very similar. The first, everybody always asks us. I, you probably get this more than more than any other question. Uh, I, I, at least I do. Is What's your favorite one? What's your favorite movie? Which one, right? Everybody. Right, we get that a lot. But I always say the I always say the first movie because of the same reason. Because everybody was just excited to have a job. Like Zac Efron, nobody knew who Zac Efron was. Yeah, nobody knew, yeah. He did this little tiny series before that called Summerland on uh, like a CW summer show. And that was it. Like Ashley Tisdale was the only one that had worked before. She did uh, Zac and Cody. Yeah, Sweet Life of Zac and Cody. And then other than that, like nobody really had worked at all. Um, and I, I knew, um, I knew Kenny from Newsies. Did you know that? I knew him from Newsies. You knew that, right? Yes, I did know that. Uh, but, it, but we were so, we thought we were just making this little Disney Channel movie. Yeah, and it was untitled, by the way. I it's don't know untitled. if you guys know this, but High School Musical was just like a working title. They didn't know what they were going to call this thing. So they were just calling it High School Musical, but then it yeah. stuck. Yeah. So to answer your question, it was the entire first movie. But I, for me, I had that moment when we were doing, um, I wasn't in the in this song, but it was uh, Stick to the Status Quo. S in the cafeteria, and I, I was sitting in Video Village with Kenny watching, watching him like choreograph this scene while they were shooting. It was amazing, I've never seen like in my life. And it was like, this isn't a little movie, this is special, this is really magical. So I think it was that moment of like us being together, like as a family, no, nobody was a big star, and it was like the beginning of something really, really cool. Thank you. Du coup, la question était, quel a été, on va dire, meilleur, 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 et je dis comme toi, hein, meilleur souvenir de, de tous les films qu'ils ont fait, même la réunion, tout ce qu'ils ont filmé ensemble. Et donc, on avait qui ici qui a commencé par dire, vous, vous connaissez bien sûr la chanson We're all in this together. Et B, à un moment, il est en train de filmer, elle dit tout le monde est en train de danser, et hop, Kenny dit pop, 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 on arrête tout. Et personne ne comprenait pourquoi, et c'est là qu'il dit Vous sentez pas quelque chose Vous sentez pas quelque chose de, de spécial Qu'on est vraiment en train de faire quelque chose qui va changer et révolutionner le monde Et là, tu vois tout le cast comme ça, recouvert de, comment on appelle ça, de la chair de poule. Tout le monde était là en mode, mais oui, mais c'est vrai qu'on va vraiment changer le monde avec tout ça. Et fun fact, c'est que ce projet de base, il n'avait pas de nom. Il était juste là en mode, eh, bah, oui, c'est un film sur euh, le lycée, donc high school en anglais. Puis, enfin, on chante, donc c'est une comédie musicale, en anglais c'est musical. Enfin, du coup, bah, high school musical, et puis bam Regardez, aujourd'hui, c'est une sensation. C'est connu, c'est génial. Donc, euh, c'était juste incroyable pour eux. Et Bart a rajouté comme quoi. D'ailleurs, ils reçoivent toujours... Clairement la question de quel est votre film favori Donne-moi ton film favori ou là je veux savoir c'est quoi ton film favori Et Bart répond à chaque fois le premier. Parce que personne encore était une star. Hein. Zac Efron, pff, connu de quoi Il avait fait juste Summerland, Viteuf. 
Qui d'autre La seule personne qui avait fait quelque chose, c'était Ashley Tisdale. Elle avait fait genre la, la vie de, de Zach et Cody. Voilà. Euh, sinon, oh, oh, lui, il a rencontré Kenny, c'était à Newsies. Tout le monde était encore petit, il y avait encore ambiance familiale, cosy. Donc c'était juste parfait selon eux. Et euh, pour lui, c'était lorsque pendant la chanson de Sick to the Status Quo, où c'est dans un cafétéria. Et il voyait Kenny comme ça, chorégraphier tout le monde et dire Toi, tu vas là, toi, tu vas là. Et Bart, il était là en mode mmh, J'ai l'impression que c'est pas un petit film, tout ça. Mmh. Voilà, voilà. I am going to go off of my favorite ones to film. How about that? Yeah, my favorite one to film was High School Musical 2 because we were all away living together in these little casitas that were attached and it felt like we were really at summer camp together. Like I would cook dinner for Zach and Vanessa and they'd come over. I'd help Ashley with her laundry. It was so fun. And I feel like you felt that in the movie. So number two was my favorite to film. Number one is classic and magical. And number three, we had big budgets. <laughs> so we had big dance numbers and lots of like flashy sets. And I really liked that. <laughs> I'm gonna say uh, to film, uh, Probably one, like one is like so magical. And I know a lot, a lot of people, their favorite is number two. Whose favorite is number two? Whose favorite is number one? Whose favorite is number three? He's mine. It's pretty even. Yeah, pretty even. Pretty even. yeah I think mine's, I think it's one, three, and two, actually, for me. For I like being in the school. Like, summer was fun to watch, but I, I like being in the school. Let's be, there's more basketball than one and three, so, you know. All right. Du coup, la question était, quel était euh, leur, enfin, faire un classement de tous les rêves musicaux Et Casey a commencé par dire, vous savez quoi, de faire un classement basé sur celle qu'elle a préférée filmer. Elle a commencé par High School Musical 2, parce que c'était vraiment juste génial. Ils étaient, on va dire, loin, c'était pas en danse d'école, mais comme s'ils allaient à un camp de vacances ensemble. Elle allait leur préparer à manger à Zach et Vanessa. Elle allait aider à acheter Tisdale avec eux pour euh, ranger ses affaires, enfin, c'était vraiment juste comme si c'était en vacances et pas vraiment là pour travailler, donc c'était vraiment top. Sinon après c'était High School Musical 1 parce que c'était la famille, l'amour, la découverte, le départ, et c'était on finissait avec le 3 qui était du budget, on donne du budget, c'était flashy, c'était grand, c'était énorme, c'était la chimie de 3. Ensuite on a Bart qui a dit comme quoi pour lui, High School Musical 1 était son préféré pour les mêmes raisons qu'il avait cité auparavant. Le deuxième c'était High School Musical 3 parce que aussi lui il adore le fait d'aller à l'école, d'être avec un terrain de basket, enfin, tout ce qui est coaching et ça va beaucoup avec son personnage. Et enfin le dernier c'était High School Musical 2 parce qu'il y avait moins de basket mais il y avait de la Voilà voilà.